Hey, once again welcome back to my youtube channel in today's tutorial i'm going to show you how to create a custom email for your business so this is my website when you visit my website you see a custom email when you even click on the contact form you see a custom email that's you can easily send email to me direct that's info at agitechgh.com so that's a custom email you can create any email at all for your business if you even go to get in touch you're basically going to get the same thing so you have info at adjectechdh.com if you want to do admin or your name at your business.com you can easily do that so i'm going to walk you through how to create a custom email for your business okay so what we need to do is to go to your c panel that's your control panel once you press choose the hosting you should have access to your c panel and this time around most hosting platform has this particular c panel so when you visit your c panel all you need to do is to move down to the email section of your control panel that's your c panel and we have emails forwarders email routing and others i'll talk about the others in the subsequent videos remember to subscribe and don't forget to turn on post notification for more of such videos from my youtube channel there's a lot of tutorial i have and i'll be creating more of that so let's see how we can create this custom email so this is the email section of the c panel so go and then click on email accounts So when you click on the email account you can see this is the section where i've created several custom email for my clients some as design at uh, therapy.com and others so we want to create a new custom to create a new custom email for a business so what you need to do is to go ahead and click on create and we need to specify the domain in which we want to create the email on so in this case i want to basically create it on my own domain name there are several domain names you can create it on so this is the domain you want to create that custom email on. So you need to first select that. And then the username. The name is basically going to be, if you want it to be info at your business.com or whatever you can do that, you can easily do admin. I've already created info at adiotech.com. So maybe probably I want to add a different one. So I can say contact. Contact. So it's going to be contact at. So you can see the other extension will follow. So it's going to be contact at adiotech.com j.com if i go ahead and i select a different domain name it's going to change accordingly so you can see now it's going to be contact at azilaj.com so that is how basically this is going to work so when you do that you have to go ahead and set a password for this you can basically generate a password for this if you want to use the password generator you can just click on this and it's going to generate a password for you okay so you can see the password i have over here you can easily generate that let me generate a different one so it's going to be a hidden password so you just do that and then you use that password to create the email so once you are done with this the next step is for you to click on create so from the top here you can see you have created contact at adiotechgh.com so i've easily created that email and i can use it anytime at all i want you can see there's option for me to be able to assess and also use that email to send information i'll do another video on how to easily contact or reach people via this particular email that you created how you can easily use that i'm going to show you how to do that but remember to subscribe for more of such video on my youtube channel till i come away again bye bye